Okay, this is the latest generator that I got for that off-road off grid here. Now, I've converted it to run on natural gas. You can see the gas line coming right through here. And it goes through solenoid valve. That's my safety valve. Just in case the generator were to quit, this valve will shut off the gas. It'll completely cut it off and it'll kill the engine, everything. Uh, even if just the power stops for some reason. If the breaker trips, it'll kill the engine. Anyway, go from there. This is the easiest one I've ever converted. Up here, and there's a vapor line that used to plug in right here. It's, I just got the line stuck in there inside of this fuel hose. The fuel hose off of the old one that I had. And it just goes down to the breather box. And once you get it started on gasoline and switch it over, well, you just turn the gasoline off. Let it start running out of gas. As it's running out of gas, slowly turn this valve on as it run, you know, as it's spitting and sputtering. When it finally quits, you should have the valve almost all the way on. Well, about there. As you can see, it's not completely on, but it's almost on. And that's about the right mixture for it to run. And it's really easy to adjust running into the air box. I had always drilled the intake manifold to do that, but whatever works. Well, as you can see, this cord right here runs to an extension cord, and that has had a light out here to light up uh, the area so I can work on it in the middle of the night if I have to. And here I have a power supply that runs the little solenoid valve, safety valve. Okay, what I'll do is I will start it up. Let me uh, see if I can get the camera kind of set up somewhere. I don't know. It's my cell phone, so I don't know exactly how it's going to sit or where it's going to sit. Maybe on my toolbox here. Maybe not. That's another generator, but that's another story, too. That's a bigger one. Okay. I'm back here. I'm sorry, brother. I don't have any way to support my cell phone. Okay, there you go. You can pretty much see. I'll go through the process of starting it and switching it over to natural gas. You can see what I'm talking about.
Thank you. 